Alrighty, everybody, welcome back to Buddy's Big Screen. I am Buddy, that is Jake, and we just got out of Monkey Man. Now, what is Monkey Man? A lot of people on the internet, including this video, are gonna reference John Wick as a comparison because they're both great action movies that kind of take a lot of similarities between each other, but are drastically different in a lot of ways. And I think honestly comparing John Wick to Monkey Man is kind of a disservice to Monkey Man. Dev Patel is starring in this movie, wrote this movie, and it's his first time directing ever. And he chose an action movie. So was it good? Yes. The short answer, the simple answer is yes. <laughs> This is the new era of action movies. I think John Wick Chapter 4 wrapped things up perfectly. I don't need anything else in that franchise because I have Monkey Man. You ready, John? Yeah. <laughs> so what is Monkey Man about? It has a lot of wonderful emotional moments behind it. It is a strong narrative. This film is so confident in every single level of filmmaking. Dev Patel does a great job at being a first time director, a fantastic actor, bringing everything home. This is Dev Patel's passion project. Uh, you know, he's very similar to like Superman in, in the sense that he splits his chest in the iconography and flies. And, um, you know, for me, you know, he was also a hero that lost faith in himself. He didn't, he didn't have courage at one point and, and needed to be reminded of who he was. So that was kind of the kind of basis of the story for me. So handing the microphone over to Jake. Jake, why don't you tell me what made this movie special to you? Hello, everyone. So in my humble opinion on Monkey Man, story-wise, phenomenal. It sets up the movie so well in the beginning and then it just progresses and just gets even better and better towards the end visuals are insane colors fight scenes everything in it is just spot on even when it comes to like the gore and everything that you get from those said fight scenes impeccable i i i can't i don't know what else to say, like say that good like it's, it's just incredible. I think this movie is phenomenal on every level. And I think you absolutely described it in, in the most perfect way. Like every detail from the beginning to the end, it, it gets better every second it goes on because it builds on each other. It builds on every single moment, every character moment, every decision, every edit, the camera movement, the placement, the choreography. This movie is insane. And the fact that it was made on $10, $10 million. Yep makes it even more incredible. I think what really stands out for me is the camera work. Seeing Dev Patel really know how to direct exactly what kind of vision he wants. It's like if you can instill confidence in the people that you work with, because every day on set, it can feel like a battle. So in every actor, I, I, I knew the days going, I knew we're never gonna get this set back. It's a monsoon rain outside, we're absolutely effed. And I'm like, it doesn't matter if we have to do this 50 times, we are gonna get this together. Like it felt so personal. And I think it makes more sense now after seeing the film, why he had to star in the role. If anybody else would have done this, if he would have given this project to someone else, it would not have been this good. It would have flopped. Like if you want original movies, if you want really creative stuff, you don't wanna see the same slop every year, go sit in the theater, and have a wonderful time. In all honesty, for how the ending is set up, I would personally like a Monkey Man Part 2. I I think if this movie is very successful, which I hope it does because it is so good, it it just it needs to happen. It just does. I I have no other words without without having to do spoilers. So I I can't really say much. Just go watch the movie. Go watch it. Please. Times are ever changing, movies are changing, the landscape in general is always moving, always doing random things. This is one of those movies you do not want to miss. Is it better than John Wick? Yes. Is it worse than John Wick? Yes. Whatever. 
they're they're great action movies. They're phenomenal. Some of the best, the very best. And I think we're living in a great time, a renaissance for action movies. Mm-hmm. I don't need a John Wick chapter five. I don't want one. I want Monkey Man chapter two. That's all I got to say. Any last thoughts? No, sir. We're going to wrap it up here, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by. Back. We're back at Buddy's Big Screen. You're not going to want to miss any videos coming up. Next week, we're going to be reviewing Civil War, and I am so excited to see it. Please, if there's one last thing I can ask of you guys, go buy that Monkey Man ticket. Do Just do it. Do it. All right. I would mic drop, but like this is expensive, so it's like... <laughs> That's all I got. Take care, guys.